When vertical farming on aeroponic towers, it is important to prepare your nutrients following a systematic protocol to ensure that your nutrients are mixed correctly for healthy plant growth. To get started, you are going to want to mix your stock nutrient A in its container. To do this, first fill up your nutrient A container one third with water and then open up your bucket labeled A1. Pour those nutrients into the container. You're then going to want to take a PVC tube to mix the nutrients thoroughly and continuously in a circular motion. This can take some time since you need to make sure that the nutrients are fully dissolved. Keep stirring your nutrients and make sure to create a whirlpool in the water. Sometimes the nutrients will accumulate in the middle of the container, so make sure that you stir in the center of the container as well as the exterior parts in a clockwise or counterclockwise motion. Continue this motion until the nutrients A1 are semi-dissolved. Then add more water to your container so that it is two-thirds full and add your nutrient stock labeled A2 to the container. Continue the same mixing process by stirring the nutrients until they are dissolved. This can take some time, so be patient. It can take up to 20 minutes or more to fully mix these nutrients until the nutrients are dissolved. After adding nutrients A1, add the Ziploc bag which has all the trace elements in it. Mix that into the container as well. Finally, add more water until the level of the small hole which is in your container. This is the limit of where the water goes to. Once you have finished mixing your nutrients A, it is time to proceed with mixing nutrients B in the other container labeled B. Before you mix nutrients B, it is absolutely crucial that you don't use the same PVC mixing tube that you used for nutrients A. Make sure to have a separate mixing PVC pipe for nutrients B. It is essential that you don't cross-contaminate even one drop of nutrients A into nutrients B. You have to keep this separate, otherwise you can ruin your batch of nutrients. So please keep this in mind and make sure to use two different mixing sticks for nutrients A and nutrients B. With nutrients B, you are going to want to follow the same procedure as you did for nutrients A. Start by adding one-third water into the container. Add stock nutrients B1 into it. Mix thoroughly until semi-dissolved and then add more water before adding stock nutrients B2. Stir extensively in a circular motion, creating a whirlpool until everything is mixed. Make sure that you don't have any nutrients at the bottom of the container. Everything needs to be dissolved. Once finished, add your suction tubes into the nutrient containers and connect those to the dosatron. You will then need to turn on some water connected to the dosatron to allow for the nutrients to be progressively sucked up to the dosatron so that it can mix with the nutrients. You will see the nutrients going up little by little through the suction tubes until it finally reaches the dosatron. Once it reaches the dosatron, you may now fill up your aeroponic tower reservoirs as well as your gravity tank with the nutrient water.